Hey guys, what is up? It's Jared from CLC Clashes, and finally, I am back. Um, <clears throat> sorry if my voice sounds a little bit off. Um, allergy season and whatnot. Um, but, I don't know, for those of you that were subscribed before, you can see the base has changed a lot. Uh, my heroes are now almost level 20 and level 15, and the walls, significant amount done, as well as being Town Hall 10. Uh, currently, I'm in this clan, Arbaria. It's pretty cool. Uh, I have a couple friends here, so you're welcome to join. We're currently trophy pushing, so that's what I'm going to be doing today, just showing off. I know everyone does all archer, so <clears throat> for now, that's not going to be that exciting, but um, eventually, I think I have some cool attack strategies planned, maybe some different stuff than people typically throw in. Um, I know strategies that I used when I was around at Town Hall 8, Town Hall 9, um, and I think maybe they'll still work now. Um, hopefully against some Town Hall 9s, I don't think they would be as effective on a Town Hall 10, uh, just from experience. Um, <clears throat> just other quick things, I have moved up, I think I finished right before Master 1 on my last trophy push, and then I kind of got busy with school and whatnot. So let's see if we can boost these up. Um, sure, we'll boost those up. Um, and see what we can do here, so. Uh, not today. So ideally I want to find something, a lot of trophies available in pretty easy Town Hall, Town Hall 8 and below, fairly low level defenses, primarily the Mortar. Um, the great thing about Town Hall 7 is that they only have um, three Mortars. Let's take a look. This is a horrible base design. As you can see, Mortar 1, Mortar 2, Mortar, um, where the Mortars are. Just... There's no triangulation there. Um, 21 trophies available. Sure, we'll just go for this, just so I can show you kind of how I would attack this. Um, so I know that that's free. I think that that's free too. This might even be free. No, we have the mortar. Um, <clears throat> so let's just start now. I'll go like this. I don't pick buildings off as much as some people do. I kind of go for a mass around, try to just because I know that they're in range of the defenses, I don't, I think that a mass works better. Uh, let's see. So right now we're at 25%. As you can see, most of those outside buildings are taken out. So now I can see where the mortars are firing. Um, I know that these bottom ones are low. Let's see. That'll go down. This needs like two guys, three guys. Gals, sorry. Uh, good, it should go down, good. 40%, uh, okay, let's see, we can definitely get those out of the way. And then the next place I'm gonna go from is up here because as you can see, a lot of this is gonna be out of that mortar range just because of how poorly um, this guy laid them out. There's no triangulation at all. Um, it's kind of in a line. Some people did that back um, a while ago and it wasn't that effective and I found. So we have a minute 30, so let's try to drop in our king here. Maybe he'll be smart and try to get into the center there. Because two stars are always good. Uh, we'll just throw down all his archers, doesn't really matter. <clears throat> um, no, he's gonna walk around. That's unfortunate. Let's see, here's what I like to do. Sometimes when they walk around, you can if you take out the stuff that they might go to later, um, they'll stop walking around, but that's not a guarantee. As you can see, he is walking all the way around. All right. We're gonna activate that ability there. Okay, that look at this king. All right, maybe these archers up top will be able to finish off the job if the king will shield just a little bit longer. Uh, maybe not. Let's see what we can do with four archers. Maybe they'll... Oh, don't go over there. Okay. I don't think we're going to be able to take out that town hall, unfortunately, because, I mean, we're at 78%, but no town hall. Okay. Fortunately, I don't have my queen. She is on leave, becoming level 20, which is going to be awesome, because I always love the hero ability level ups. Okay, we're going to just end that there. And let's see. Seven cups. Not horrible for a one star. Let's see. 
awesome. So the next video, um, getting into that already would be, is going to be that Town Hall 8 attack strategy, which is kind of a golem wizard. Um, sometimes you can throw heroes in there too, but there's no witches or pekkas, which makes it good for, you know, a Town Hall 8. Um, and you really don't need that many spells with it, I've found, which is good because it's, I mean, golems aren't cheap and wizards aren't cheap, but not having spells keeps the cost down a little bit. Um, stuff that I'm working on is these Teslas. I don't know if you guys remember when I was making videos before the Teslas I had, I think were level level three, which was embarrassing because um, I was a Town Hall 10. But because I'd always push them off because they take so long and they're fairly resource heavy. So now when all these things start costing, you know, six and six and a six and a bit million um i was like okay well now i got now i gotta do these so the things i have to finish up i have to finish up the cannon it's got one level and then this archer tower over here so once those are done i'll be kind of fully equal then to be honest at this point in the game i don't prioritize air defense and that's because lava hounds are so overpowered and balloons and lava hounds just simply can't be stopped by air defense. I feel like when air defenses were initially developed, they were developed for dragons because that was the most used air troop, and they did very good against that. But people don't attack with dragons anymore, especially because of the hounds and other things. The thing is, this base is great because these Teslas um, almost act as second air defenses, and based upon the archer tower placement you can see here, they do a pretty good job of covering that air defense. So between this trifecta one, two, three, and this completes it, which would be the Seeking Air Mine. It does a pretty good job of defending against um, wizard, um, ugh, hounds, actually. So let's see defense log. I've been winning a lot. Um, one night I got absolutely destroyed. I forgot that the Dark Elixir was so far out and I had so much when I changed the base to a trophy and I pretty much lost like 20,000 Dark Elixir that night. It was horrible. Um, yeah, I don't have any replays from balloons but I'm sure I'll have some when um by the time the next video comes around as far as that goes yeah um so this is just a quick video to tell you that I'm back and that I'm looking forward to posting videos hopefully daily um if not every other day um all right see ya please be sure to like, subscribe, and when these videos have ads, please click them, because that's how I make money. And I think that's it. Just share with your friends, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, comment down below. I'll be sure to be active, respond to all your comments quickly, efficiently. And that's it. Have a good one.